Howdy all. Ever reckon about making some big old life changes and starting something brand new? Well, reckon I did just that. Fixing to switch from being a full-time fairy and the horse trainer in Germany to finally making a living as independent country rock artist, hopefully right yonder in the good old United States of America one day. But before we get to that, for all y'all who ain't met me yet, I'm Toby Shitkins from Germany and I've been making a living in the, the past 20 years or something uh, training western horses and taking care of them hooves. Now I'm fixing to dive headfirst into the music scene. Now I want to tell you all about my journey, where I'm from and where I'm heading to and so on. So, first things first, for all of you watching the video version of this, do not wonder I've kind of a backup script for this episode in front of my face cause I'm not that great storyteller by nature. I'm actually quite introverted, trying to push my boundaries. You always have to come out of your comfort zone to reach goals and this is what I'm doing right now. So now, let's dive right in. Well, me and my wifey, we live out on a little horse ranch here in Germany where we're running our horse business and uh, I tell you, I just love that lifestyle out here in the countryside. Um, I raised up in the rural part of Germany and never had a hankering for nothing else. Um, but something like this. Actually, I feel like I'm born in Germany, but with a downright American soul. I love the American way of life and them traditions, and the Lordy, I do love English, um, especially that Southern accent. And by the way, let me know what y'all think about my attempt to sprinkle in some of that Southern drawl. Y'all reckon it fits, or should us Germans uh, just stick to our own lingo? Looking forward to hearing your thoughts down in the comments. Now back to the tale. I reckon most fellas wanted to play cowboy when they uh, was just young guns and knee high to a grasshopper, but for me it was more than just a fancy. I uh, can't rightly describe how downright happy I was when I found out I could make a living uh, training them western horses. I was that white fella sporting the cowboy hat and boots in my 10th grade graduation photo smack dab in the middle of Germany. I weren't just playing cowboy. I was living that lifestyle and I still am. Over and beyond, I always aim to make a living from things I truly love to do. As they say, when you're doing something you truly love, you ain't working one day in your life. For me, there's just two things I truly love and they're training them western horses and country rock music. After school I didn't see no way to make a damn for music, so I decided to focus mainly on horse training. I was an assistant trainer for about 6 or 7 years uh, before I struck out on my own and later on I picked up Ferry Rain 2. Along the way I even ran a horse tech online shop and focused on importing ropes from the United States to sell them over here in Europe. One day while I was sitting in the office I came across an online ad from a music distribution service and that was the day I figured out a simple way to make some extra coin of music. So I dug through all of my old hard drives, dusted off some old recordings I'd done over the years and uploaded them to the distributor just to see how it all would work out. After getting the first bits of feedback I thought, alright, let's invest some time and money into this and see where it all leads. I tried a few different things and I decided to make it a mite more seriously, turn it into a proper business. So I needed to be able to produce my music on a professional quality. Now that's what led me to become a professional audio engineer and uh, opened up my studio called Simple Life Studio. Well I thought when I'm recording and producing my own music, I could also do this for other artists. And now I'm at a point where I've poured about three years into setting up this whole ecosystem for my music business, started with a studio as an online service and uh, an merch store, old damn social media accounts and finally an official business called Shitkins LLC. Also worth a mention at this place is my Simple Life Society. If you don't know about Simple Life Society, this is a special place for my community where you get early access to unreleased music and podcast episodes, as well as a really raw and unedited behind the scenes knowledge and much more. All for about two coffees a month. When I started taking this music thing a mite more seriously, I set myself a deadline and I wanted to be able to make a living from music by 2025. Another reason I got into this music business is cause I need a revenue stream that ain't tied to a local area like my horse business and why? Cause I'd love to move to the United States in a couple years. So I need a way to earn money online from anywhere in the world and uh, selling my music as well as mixing and mastering online is just such a way. Now you all know a bit about who I am, what I'm doing and where I am to go. I'm fixing to share my whole journey on my accounts like Instagram, Facebook and YouTube. And if you all join me on this journey, feel free to hit that subscribe button here on YouTube and uh, follow me on Instagram. 
when you'd like me to keep up with this podcast format let me know i guess i'll bring up a new episode each thursday if you want me to and to make sure you don't miss out on any new stuff i'm bringing up sign up to my email list there are lots of other benefits coming up with a subscription to my list like extra discounts for the merch store early access to unreleased music and uh, much more behind the scenes stuff that all comes directly to your mailbox and this is a way we can keep in touch even without all that social media stuff and if you want to go the extra mile and support me on my journey give this here video a thumbs up if you like it and uh, share my videos and music and podcast episodes with your family and friends really dive deep into my journey and connect with the community think about joining simple life society as i mentioned before don't forget to let me know what you think about my attempt to bring in some thousand x in i really would like to know what you think drop your comments uh, shoot me a message or whatever so there's nothing left to say for today i wish you all the very best love you all and i'm out see you next time ciao